It's been more than 20 years since the Devils brand was involved in a national basketball competition, but that's about to change, with Hobart and Townsville announced as the two foundation clubs for the new Champions League basketball three-on-three competition. There's been other, other sports that have uh, you know, had periods of time playing under that, that Devils name, but for us, uh, you know, really exciting to have that. It's certainly generated a lot of interest and our, our players are, are really excited to get out with those new uniforms on shortly. Three on three is an international phenomenon, but it's only just starting to hit its groove in Australia. Played on half a court, matches last just 10 minutes and are often played outdoors and in communities, not big stadiums. We've got a, a, a purpose built, it's a fever endorsed and uh, fever licensed court that we, we lay down. So we've got that that can uh, essentially be set up anywhere in Tasmania. Uh, you know, portable backboard and, and floor that can be laid down. Hobart's men's team will be led by foundation players Elijah Pawson, BJ Radcliffe and Matthew Young, while the women's team are yet to announce a third player to join Ellie Collins and Shana Thompson. Our plan would be to have some, some broader tryouts. Uh, we just had some time pressures with this event, but certainly our goal is to have a squad of, of eight men and eight women. And this is the strip the team will wear, with the Tasmanian Devil a prominent feature. Hobart will play its first matches in a tournament in Melbourne on Saturday week with the hope of bringing games to Tasmania next summer. I'd love to have something down on the waterfront. I think, you know, Hobart, the heart and soul of Hobart is, is down on the water and you've got the, the city and the mountain. And I think, you know, three and three basketball would be a, a perfect sport to, to drop into that environment. Brent Costello, Win News.